Here's a shoe photography hack that I bet you didn't know. Shoe trees are great for shoe photography because they fill out the shoe, make it look as if it is on someone's foot, as you can see in this example right here. But what happens if the shoe is, say, a mule? and it doesn't have a back portion of the shoe for the spring to press up against. Here's what I do in that situation. For this example, I'm using these Converse Shorelines. I didn't have an actual mule in my garage at the moment. When photographing these, I wanna make sure that the customer clearly knows that it's the Shoreline model and that the heel is relaxed. So I just wanna fill out the front of the shoe and keep the back looking just as it is right now. Now, a lot of people don't actually know this, but the spring portion of the shoe tree is actually removable. If you twist it just a little bit, and then give it a nice little pull, it's gonna come right apart. And then you can just sit this to the side and insert just the toe portion into the shoe, and that's gonna display the shoe perfectly as if someone's foot was feeling up the front portion of this shoe.